What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Moto WordPress Teams and in today's video we're gonna learn how to embed Google Forms into our WordPress page, widgets, sidebar, posts or any section of our WordPress website for free. So in this tutorial we're gonna learn how to embed Google Forms that is an amazing survey way that works online to collect data and it's very organized, work on mobile, it's fast, it's easy and it's free. So it's probably the best solution for data collection. So, how to embed this in WordPress is what I'm gonna learn into this video, and I'm gonna explain to you two methods: one using codes and one without using codes. So, keep there, hit the like button, subscribe this channel because we bring daily videos about WordPress, SEO, plugins, optimizations, and many, many more topics. Not just internet on site's favor, and let's get this started. Very first thing to do is go to google.com you can go to the type google forms on google and you're gonna be into a page almost like this one you can go to forms you're gonna be able to create your form and after doing this you can be into a page almost like this one you can customize the form you can change the colors in the case that you want you can change the intensity of the colors you can apply some image, you can change the font, the font size, you can apply some settings to your form, the responses, and everything. It's easy because it's one of the best Google tools on the planet. So after this, we're gonna need to share this form, to send this form for someone or to embed it. After, go to the upper right corner of your screen. Next, your photo, click on send. You can send via email, you can send using the link, or you can use the embed HTML. And right here you have the option to change the widget and the H. And we have the collect email addresses. Do not collect, verify it, responder input. Okay? It's up to you as well. It, I recommend that you collect the email address as well for a better communication and follow up but you can choose the best option that suits your needs. We're gonna start embedding HTML, the code solution. Copy this code, you're gonna select right here and copy. Now, move to our WordPress dashboard, review the left sidebar of menus, hover a mouse over the section where you would like to apply your Google form. In my case, it's gonna be into one of my posts, so go to posts. Select one of the posts. Once you load the post editor, you're gonna be able to apply some space. Imagine that I would like to apply the Google Form after the first paragraph. So, click into the end of the first paragraph, type enter. You're gonna be able to see a little plus button. If you hover over it, you're gonna see add block. Click on it. Now into the search for widgets field, we're gonna type HTML, just like this. You can place the code that you copied on Google right here. If you go to preview, you're gonna be able to see the Google form nice and working, okay? But this is the code solution. If you like this one, just hit the publish button or update the post and you are good to go, okay? But if not, we have another solution for you. Still on WordPress, review the left sidebar of menus, hover a mouse over plugins and click on add new plugin. Into the upper right corner of our screen, next to keyword, we're gonna type embed, just like this. Screw it down just a little bit until you can find this option right here. Embed Press, Embed PDF, YouTube, Google Docs, Vimeo, Insta, Videos, Audios, Maps, and any documents in Gutenberg and Elementor. Click on Install now. Click into the Activate button. This is gonna redirect you to the plugins list, a list where you can see all of the present plugins on your site.
Now, if you reveal the left sidebar on your WordPress dashboard once again, next to appearance you're gonna be able to find a new button called Embed Press. Right here, you can send the global embed frame, some short codes, and the most important part, the sources, okay? Right here, we're gonna be able to see how many social medias and sites can be embedded on your site after this plugin installation. And of course, all for free. Now, let's go to our post. Find the post where I would like to embed the content. Remember that you can embed the form into any section of your site. You can even, for example, enter with a column layout and apply the form only into the first health column, okay? Now, click into the plus button and now we're gonna search for Google. Just like this. And the guide that we're looking for is this one, Google Forms. Google Form URL. All we have to do is go back to our Google Form and find the URL option into the middle one, link. Copy that, place into WordPress and click on embed. And here is your form. Nice and working. Simple, easy, fast and very effective, okay? After change made, you can hit the save change button or update the post and you are good to go. And that is. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Feel free to choose the comment section below in the case that you have any question. Don't forget to check out our borderless plugin to gain widgets, elements, templates and tools to build up your site using Element or Gutenberg. Or Enzu WordPress team, the best free WordPress team that can start to customize your site in the way that you want. Or Growth.net platform. Grow for GWs in order to promote your blog. You can submit your blog for receiving and publishing guest posts. Or sites.gallery, a place where you can promote your site for free. You can promote your mobile design, your app, your game, your landing page, your promotion, or campaign. Everything that you want, it's for free. You're going to be awarded and you're going to connect with a growing designer's community. And as a final note, in the case that you want to go premium while doing your site, Go to visualmodel.com, purchase the Visual Model Pass and unlock full access to our entire template library with hundreds of pre-built type sites that you can import with a single click. In addition for premium icons, assets, blocks, templates, tools, plugins and many many more pro features. And it is, hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you tomorrow. All the best!